Hi there, everyone. This is Mailman Zero playing Earthbound. Let's get to it. When last we met, our friend Jeff joined us down here in the dungeon, bursting through the top of the ground area, falling down and making this heap of rubble. And of course, we are stuck. I have no idea what to do at this point. Let us think a little bit about what we're supposed to possibly do at this point in the game. Hmm. Machine that opens doors, especially when you have a slightly bad key. Yeah. Because that was really inconvenient. Ah, so there is a point to Jeff being here. It just might work. Let's give it a try. Come on, Jeff. Don't let us down. We'll use the bad key machine. And the door miraculously opens. And we're in Glow in the Dark Land. And immediately, we are attacked. Okay, this this looks frightening. Let's focus our attacks on the zombie possessor. Because I don't like getting possessed. We'll just have them do that. I think uh, Jeff probably should be defending. Oh, I'm glad to get rid of him. Let's see if we can do something similar to this guy, and we'll just go ahead and defend again with Jeff. Oh, that was a good battle. Yay, Jeff! Level 10! I didn't realize his level was that high already. He should be alright. We, we still need to get him some levels up, though. Ooh, another Don't Enter sign. Man. I really wish that I could use that butterfly. Well, let's see what's in here. Oh, good. It's the putrid moldy man and his cohort. Let's try a good old one two punch and see how it goes. We'll try some paralysis on the smelly ghost. And then we'll try some. Freeze Beta on the Putrid Moldy Man. And I guess we can shoot with stuff for fun. Goodbye, Putrid Moldy Man. Well, he's useful. Let's just attack him, I guess. Oh, good. So, nothing's useful really except for Ness's attack. I sure hope it stays numb enough to die before it attacks us. Oh, finally. I guess everyone else is too weak for anything to have any effect. Go, Jeff! Finally, some maximum hit point... hit point awesomeness. And the smelly ghost is gone. Another level up for Jeff. Go level 12. Oh, baby! At this rate, it's not going to take too long for him to get there. Uh-oh. Okay, I guess we can't fight him. So, let's find some more enemies in the graveyard, because you know the graveyard is the safest place to find enemies. At least it keeps those crazies away from us. Let us continue on the path of getting Jeff some points of experience. You know what? I just realized. Before we do that, why don't we go and, like, get Jeff some equipment? I don't know why I didn't do that first. 
Okay, Jeff, what goods do you have? You have a stun gun, a broken air gun, and a pop gun. I guess we can sell a pop gun. Good buy pop gun? Yes, of course. I would like to buy some stuff, but I probably can't afford what I'm looking for. So I need a hard hat and a copper bracelet. Um, also, Jeff has too much stuff. So, let's get some money. Okay, and we can call Escargo Express. Okay, I guess I'll call Dad. Let's try Escargo Express this time. So we'll pick up the stuff that Jeff has that we won't need again in the game. Yay, Escargo Express! Come on, Escargo Express! Okay, let's take some of this stuff. We can get rid of the bad key machine. And we can get rid of the... something or other. Oh, look at that. I didn't even equip the cheap bracelet on Jeff. That was silly of me. We can take the pack of bubble gum. Uh, no, not for now. Yes. And back to the drugstore. Now that we've got some space freed up for Jeff, we can buy some stuff, like a hard hat. Jeff, of course. Yes. 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 Uh, we'll get him a bracelet, because he needs to look pretty. Jeff, of course. Equip it, and we get some defense. That's good for now. Oh, no, actually, I can sell a uh, pop gun. I think. Did I already do that? Stun gun. Why did I think that he had another gun? Defense spray. Well, I can sell the defense spray. Let's do, do that. Oh, and the cheap bracelet. We'll sell a cheap bracelet. No, that'll do it. Alright. And, uh... I don't know how much they cost. I don't know if I brought it up. Wait, what's in here? Oh, nothing. I need to get up to that guy. Because he's got some armaments that Jeff can use, that nobody else could use. Hello, man. Uh, let's buy some stuff. Oh, see, a toy air gun. I guess I could buy that, but I think I don't need that. Oh, I thought bottle rockets cost a lot more than that. I'm going to buy a few of those. Yay! Let's see all the level ups. Go, Jeff! Yay, guts and speed and HP. What? I thought Paula was close to leveling up, too. Yeah, we got ourselves a greenie. Yay, he's dead. I mean, melted into thin air. Now Paula gets a level up, of course. Ooh, offense up alpha. Good one, Paula. I guess I don't need to... I think my status is good on everybody as far as... Oh, I guess I could use some life on just Ness. So we'll, we'll do that. Um, and we'll get this guy. We'll only recover some, but it's worth something. That's better. Attack Ness, because, you know, he's the strong one. Go, Jeff! You are a leveling up machine. Okay, that wasn't too bad, and we'll probably get a good amount of experience. Jeff's leveling up again. Awesome. Go maximum hit points, because you'll need it. Yay, Smelly Ghost is out of here! Come on, level up. Come on. Yeah, go, Jeff. Wow, that was a big one. Almost everything went up in 15 hit points. Run away from me! Yeah, got myself a green! All by myself. Well, by himself, we get ourselves a win. 
317. I would like to find him by himself again like that so that we could get ourselves some more free points. Go Jeff! Level 17. And all he gets is more hit points. I guess that shouldn't be too bad. It's respectable. Go Jeff! Another tiny victory. But he is a one level higher. Oh, and he got a friend. That's okay. They'll be gone pretty fast. Especially if that happens. Wow, that was a quick battle. Go Paula. Looking for zombies. Zombies that want to die. Hey zombies, do you want to die? Because I can make that happen if you want to die. What? Where did all the flies go? Well, this will be easy enough. Goodbye. Putrid Moldy Man's not gone. How's that possible? Just direct everything back at him. First little tap and he should be gone. Of course, Paula instead destroys him. Oh. I really thought I would be able to get a green on that. Okay, let's get that ghost out of here. Alright, get that putrid moldy man gone. We gotta... I think one more round ought to do it. Yes! And of course, Jeff's attack is useless against a smelly ghost, for reasons that are not completely clear. Well, goodbye. Your smell is no longer welcome. We should be getting close now. I didn't even realize I was an enemy until it was too late, or I could have tried it for the green. This looks familiar. Let's see what happens. Good dodging. Not good dodging. And now we just attack like normal. And before you know it, everyone's dead except for us. This should take out the moldy man. And now we just wait for Ness to finish taking out the smelly ghost. Goodbye, smelly ghost. Yeah, this is kind of a dangerous one. I, I took a bit too much of a gamble here, I think. But we'll see. Nope, I guess it wasn't too bad. Jeff is level 19. Okay. Well, I think that's going to do it for today. Jeff is now ready to battle with us. And maybe it's time to go after some bigger things. So, join me next time when we have some real battles with Jeff, who is now strong and ready to kill. I mean, make things become tame. Bye.